Greetings and best wishes. The purpose of this slideshow is to illustrate the benefits, opportunities, and features of probably the most dynamic and original marketing and networking concept ever conceived, so that support may be gathered for its establishment and development. To see the initial detailed schematics for this project, go to Scentless.com, though I have now composed an updated version since then. In order to see the content at its clearest, it's best to view this presentation full screen. Jeff Bezos became the wealthiest person on earth by founding a convenient and effective way for the global masses to market and purchase goods on the cyber highway. Then we have the world's largest auction entity, eBay, working closely with PayPal, which makes billions processing electronic transactions. Mark Zuckerberg and partners broke the bank by providing a means for the world to say hello online. And of course, Bill Gates and company are all about computers and the net thereby consistently raking in gigantic bucks. This serves to prove one thing. Computers and the internet are the greatest wealth building resources on the planet, as they are also the greatest universal implement with which to do good or bad. But while using the aforementioned very popular sites, consumers get their pockets drained from commission and or user fees, which causes them to have to raise prices for consumers or eat a loss in profits. And do these megacorps really contribute as much to benevolent causes as they should? What if there was an online source everyone could access that would cost very little to use and that granted recognition and publicity to those contributing to charitable causes benefiting earth and man? Also, what if it allowed emphasis for green and fair trade commerce? Plus more, what if it also gave recognition to those recruiting more members into its ranks? Enter Scentlist, a website app allowing members to promote goods and services and to network for constructive purposes in just about every category available. Free to join, members could post listings at minuscule fees, elevate the status of their listings in proportion to the amount they donate to charities, and recruit new members while earning recognition for such in the form of extra links leading viewers to their personal page. Members and visitors supporting ecological and humanitarian products and services or networking opportunities could also gear their searches for green and fair trade search results. The following pages feature schematics illustrating web app content users would encounter when navigating Scentless content. First, we have the Scentless home page, where you can quickly access any member via their member number, access top 100 recruiters, donors, and the current sponsors. Also, we have the login, register, and links to other pages. Further still, there was a video that could go to the web app programming firm in exchange for partial compensation for programming services, or could go to any sponsor paying for it. At bottom is the EdSpread Collective or ASC or EdSpread.com logo. ASC would be the umbrella company for Scentless as well as other enterprises. Viewing all features, using a 19-inch HP monitor for reference, there will be rotating ads down the left and right sides, as well as special deals ads at the bottom, also rotating from ad to ad every few seconds. On most of the internal pages, using the About page as an example, we'll have the header and two rotating special deal ads up top, left to right rotating ads, three sponsored video ads, and one sponsored banner ad. The portion between the right rotating ads and the video ads will be scrollable, disappearing into the top line and into the banner ad when scrolled. Scentless membership will consist of recruits and networkers, explained in detail in the next slide. The networkers page shown at right will not feature the entity or recruit selectors and will accommodate listing searches. All members will have their own personal page the public could visit. The recruits page would feature his or her identity, whether actual name or handle, the recruiter's link, an optional photo, optional charity or cause he or she especially supports, a contact link, a quick lookup for any products offered, entities registered, any members he or she has recruited, and a biography. The membership directory will serve as a means to search for recruit and or networker members via member number, personal entities, and business organizational entities. 
Green fair trade entities, entity type, and locations will also serve as filters for search results. Recruits will be those members invited to join who are considered honorable and trustworthy by sent lists or recruiters. Besides their personal entity, which is their name and info they initially registered to become a member, they may register any and all businesses or organizational entities they have official authority to represent. They may post listings, sponsor ads, and recruit other members. Networkers will be those members not recruited, though they may still post listings in all categories. The main intent is that they use sent lists for networking. The only entity they'll have is their personal entity, and they may not sponsor ads or recruit other members. The products page will allow for product searches via listing number, product code such as UPC, ASIN, etc., and condition regarding code. Categories for product listings will be for sale, seeking to buy, giving, donating, and requesting to receive. A link to the special deals page will also be featured. Here we have a for sale search for an item title, light bulbs, sold by recruits. Search results yield 850 results, partially shown in the right side graphic. The users can see the listing numbers, personal entities, recruiters, the entities selling the item type, and then the picks, titles, and some info regarding the items. Clicking on any pick or title brings forth the applicable detailed listing. In the detailed listing, besides the aforementioned data, there will be all available picks, the detailed description, and optional price and shipping info. At right is how all would appear in the aforementioned 19-inch monitor. Clicking on a pick summons its blow-up. The services page will function on the same principle as products, but, of course, will have different categories and will not have code or condition filters. And services will be scrollable, the same as products. Networking searches will allow members to hook up with others for such things as forming carpools, babysitting rings, organizations, political groups, finding employees and employers, etc. Pictures will be optional. The charities page will feature all charities and causes sent list supports. Members donating to any active ones will increase the status of their applicable listing or entity in proportion to the amount donated whereby their listing or entity will appear first in searches before those having less in donated funds, which is the main feature of making Scentless the most unique marketing and networking force on earth, that and its recruiting process. Viewers will see the total funds raised per charity and will have access to the top 100 donor and charity totals links, and clicking on any organizational name leads to the organization's site. Top 100 donors features the 100 members who currently have the highest all-time donation totals. Clicking on their name or handle leads to their personal page. Charity totals shows the all-time total funds raised by active and inactive charities from sent list members. Now we have our charity, green fair trade, and recruiter symbols and explanations. C, or C1 as an example, equal a symbol for C ranking for listing and entity result searches, also for listings on special deals and support our sponsors pages. It appears in search results where multiple members appear. Results with the highest rankings, highest donation amounts, appear first in searches and on applicable pages. Rankings go from C1 to C infinity. CC is a symbol for charitable contribution. It indicates that a charitable contribution has been made regarding an entity or listing and will appear in search results involving only an individual member. Since that particular member will be the only one with the resulting entities or listings, there will be no need for a C ranking. TD is a symbol for Top 100 Donor. It's linked to the Top 100 Donors page. It applies to the total amount donated by a member regarding all listings and all entities. goes from TD1 to TD100. TR is a symbol for Top 100 Recruiter Ranking. Works on the same principle as donors. It's linked to the Top 100 Recruiters page. And G is the symbol for Green Fair Trade listing or entity. 
Green fair trade listings and entities are also indicated by green font in search results. Here are examples of a search conducted from an entity page at left and of the resulting detailed listing partially shown at right. Both are fully loaded with symbols. C rankings are omitted because these apply only to one individual. The TD and TR rankings apply only to personal entities and only business or organizational entities can be listed as green or fair trade. Here on the left, we see a search result yielding multiple members where the C ranking would apply. At right, multiple members also comprise the special deals and support our sponsors pages with the C ranking applying there as well. Recruits and networkers will be able to leave ratings and feedback for SentList. Ratings will be in whole numbers from 0 to 100. Each member will be allowed only one feedback posting, but will be able to edit that singular posting perpetually. Ratings will appear from latest to earliest. SentList would offer employment and money-making opportunities to its members. The Opportunities page would be used to search for them locally to globally and would allow the choice of all results or just the green and fair trade ones. Announcements will follow the same format as Opportunities and will feature announcements made by SentList filtered from local to global locations and regarding all results or just the green fair trade ones. Both members and non-members would be able to contact SentList via email form. Recruitment resources would serve as a directory recruits could use to find and recruit new members. Both recruits and networkers could suggest new sources and receive a credit link leading to their personal page for all suggested sources accepted by SentList and added to the directory. The Top 100 Recruiters page will feature a list of the 100 recruiters ranked from 1 to 100, who have recruited the most recruits with active membership. Clicking a name or handle leads to that personal page. Any member sponsoring SentList by purchasing a banner, video, or rotating ad will be listed here throughout their ad's duration. All listings C-ranked. The Special Deals page will feature products and services offered by recruits that SentList considers as offering the best values to customers. The listings will be C-ranked. The listings will also appear on a rotational basis on the SentList homepage and on other pages. Clicking on a picture or title summons its detailed listing. When joining SentList, people will be able to register for recruit or networker status. People invited to join by a recruiter would enter their recruiter's member number and complete the registration form, including payment info to verify identity. Networker registrants would complete a separate form. Recruit registrants would have to be accepted by both their recruiters and by SentList, while networkers would be accepted only by SentList. Those invited by SentList to become recruits would have to complete the form but would be automatically accepted afterward. Both recruits and networkers accepted for membership will receive an email link leading to their initial login page, where after login, they access their initial profile page. Recruits shown at left will be able to visit stats concerning total listings, ad, charity donations, etc., and will be able to manage membership status, update profile info, raise the status of their personal entity by making charity donations, register additional entities, view and manage recruit matters, post and manage listings, view and manage suspensions and reported listings, view saved members, entities and listings, view special deal status, view awards, declare a charity or cause they especially support as well as view charity donation status, submit and manage ads, Opt in to receiving email ads, submit feedback regarding SentList, and manage payment methods, including their SentList account balance. Recruits registering an additional entity have the Green Fair Trade option, would select the entity's primary type, whether it deals in products, services, networking, etc., and would select the category applicable to that primary type. They would then identify the entity's official name, the position or title they hold, contact info regarding the entity, a description of the entity, 
and may add a logo or another pic representing the entity. Once the entity is registered, they may then access and manage it, as well as raise its status via charity donations. In listings, they'll be able to access and manage prior listings or post new ones under any applicable entities. They'll be able to apply for a special deal status for a new listing, designate it as Green Fair Trade, specify a product code, specify category, condition of product, submit a listing title, add pictures, give a detailed description, contact info, and specify price and shipping info. They then confirm the listing if there are no charges or pay and then confirm if charges apply, with that payment being withdrawn from their sent list account balance. Listing fees will be minuscule, for example, 10 cents per month for basic listing. Prior listings accessed can be managed and updated. whereby the listing update can be confirmed and processed if there are no charges or paid and confirmed if the updates incur charges. Charges will be for edited titles, extra titles, and for extra pictures above the free quantity limit. As said, they may also raise their listing status by amounts proportional to their charity donations. After selecting their charity choices, they may then pay for all donations with a singular payment also deducted from their sent list account balance. Reported listings will include comments about listings, which are info notes, as well as disputes filed by and against the member. Plus, the member will be able to access any suspensions or infractions charged against him or her by sent list. At left is an info note example. Disputes filed against members will be noted by sent list, with sent list reply being relayed to both parties, giving them the opportunity to resolve the matter. Multiple unsatisfactorily resolved disputes filed against a member by multiple other members may result in his or her suspension or even expulsion from membership. Clicking the Charity Donations button would bring up that page where the member can access charity donation info for use by tax officials or other parties. The member would establish a custom confidential URL for the page and relay that URL to any party he or she wants to have access to the page. The passcode would be part of that URL and would be the part they set and update. Viewers could select donation histories per entity per year, per listing per year, and per individual charities per year and all time. Above, per entity is selected for the year 2021 where the available entities, personal entity first, are listed as well as the charities and causes receiving donations for each month, the amounts donated, and when donations were made. Any business or organizational entities will be listed after the personal entity. The charity page of individual donors will allow charities to easily access the info necessary to enable them to issue receipts to their individual donors and also easily keep records on donors and donations. Each charity will be able to log in and access the donation info relative to them. Above, Habitat for Humanity logs in, where they can access donation info for any relevant year, month, member, nation, and donation level. Sponsorship advertising will serve as the main factor of subsidizing the sent list system and allowing it to charge such economical listing fees. Recruits will be able to submit ads relevant to their personal entity and any other entities registered. To submit an ad, they would select an entity, select Submit an Ad, and then the ad type, banner, rotating banner, or video. At left, Banner is selected, where afterward we see the banner title and its URL destination. Banner placement has the banner appearing on the About page. At left, we see the banner has been uploaded and the Agreement Terms box checked. The ad is then submitted for Scentless approval. If approved, Scentless will send a price quote. When paid, the ad would be eligible to be scheduled to run. The member will have a refund period whereby he or she may cancel the ad for a full refund 
or request an ad replacement. After the refund period has expired, he or she may cancel the ad, run it blank, or request an ad replacement. The member would complete a request to replace form to submit a replacement ad for approval. Members would have access to a chart showing ad space availability as well as open rates for ad types. Email ads will be sent to those members opting into receiving email promotions in their selected categories of interest. The advertiser would select the categories, give the email a title and message, and then submit the ad for approval. Above is an example of an advertiser selecting all categories of the members he or she wishes to reach. He or she would then pay an amount proportional to the sum of all members opting into those categories. After receiving sent list approval and the price quote, the member would then pay, whereupon he or she will have a deadline in which to schedule the email to run, run it immediately at any time therein, or cancel the ad for a full refund. The sent list page will allow viewers to access any ASC announcements, updates, and product or service offerings for sale. This includes ASC itself and any enterprises it houses, including sent list. Finally, here are a few app examples gauged to a five and one half inch iPhone screen. Left is the sent list home page. Below it is the page selector in use with products selected. At bottom is the products page, ready for conducting searches. This would also be the general format for most of the other public sent list pages. Next, we have for sale selected as listing type. Below that, we scroll down to search item title, and after scrolling down to click the search button, we access the search results. A search result image or title is clicked leading to its detailed listing, where an image is clicked, summoning its blow-up image. Upper left is an example of a page not needing a scroll bar, shown as the Opportunities page before search is conducted. Below that, we have an example of a full-screen page for pages or content requiring it, such as employment applications and membership registrations, as shown in the upper right image. Below that, the member clicks his name to summon his profile page, with that page also using a full screen format. So, there you have it. A very unique idea for a web app presence that accommodates commerce and networking at extremely affordable prices, provides a means for members to elevate their status while making a better world in the process, and that is economically sustainable via revenue gathered from ad sales and listing fees. Plus, it provides incentives for members to seek out others and add them to its ranks. Plus more, a future goal will be to establish a warehouse shipping delivery network or WSD network, granting merchants and customers a very economical network with which to store, ship, and deliver goods. For more about this, see the WSD model via the Green Product Fund GPF, clickable slideshow, and YouTube video URLs below and in description. The GPF is another ASC enterprise I'm seeking supporters for, which is green and fair trade goods on auction at starting bids of only one cent. People working together for the good of themselves and the planet. What more could you want to invest in? If interested in partnering with or supporting scent lists and or the GPF, contact me, Keith Anderson, at scentlist at yahoo.com. C-E-N-T-L-I-S-T at yahoo.com. Also contact me if you want to see the latest detailed schematics I designed for both sites and apps. Take care and best wishes.